Hey YouTube, we're going into round six of the Modern Challenge, currently four and one. Beating up on Lost of Tron in round two, which I thought would be Mono Red Prison, uh, White Black Tokens, Cheerios, and I can't remember what else I played. I got it all look, marked up over here though. And it'd be Elves last round. So a little bit of everything. Varieties of Spice of Life though. Looks like we're on the play, so I would like to play the die roll. Um, yeah, we're gonna keep this hand. I'm gonna lead off on. I'm gonna cycle my street wraith on one because I would like to discard spell them to start off. I'm gonna use my mana anyways, and the only thing that I so I'm gonna fetch a red black land first. I get punished if I'm playing against burn by doing this, but I'm gonna I'm gonna use my mana no matter what. All right, I'm going to leave that one just in case we're playing against Burn. Jesus. And we're just going to ditch this Battle Rage. We'll keep the third land to be able to flash the lootings back. Okay, play in humans. No play on one, sweet. Okay, Serum Visions is pretty good. I think we're going to fetch an island. We don't have a Death Shadow yet. And there's just no need to take too, too much more damage. Fatal Push is fine. I'm going to put this Gurmag Angler on the bottom. Put Fatal Push on top. What is going on here? Why can't I... Oh, okay. Whew. Uh, let's leave. I'm gonna put the leave the teamer battle rage in the graveyard. This is a tough game one matchup. The fact that we haven't and like this kind of walks right into a reflector mage, which is tough. So like I think we have to take five here. I think I just have to like fetch shock, fatal push this, look to thought sees a reflector mage. Because we just can't win if reflector mage hits the hits the table here. Just night absolute nightmare scenario here. So we're gonna take this Bob and hope they don't hit another land drop for a little while. They can meddling mage my looting, which is also pretty bad. So if my opponent hits another land drop here, I'm gonna, I'm I'm probably I'm zero percent to win this. They can just meddling mage my looting, which is a pretty solid play for them. They just play a vial, okay. That's not bad. So let's start with this. Snapcaster Mage is also great. So I'm just gonna attack. And then we're just gonna bluff a removal spell. I'm actually going to hang on. Let's what am I gonna loot away? I want my Snapcaster Mage and I want my Gurmag Angler. So I don't think I want a Faithless Looting. So I want to get rid of this, 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 and I guess, yeah, we're going to Inquisition, I think, if we get the chance to Snapcaster Mage. I think I think the Snap Battle, I think Battle Rage is, is not going to happen. We just hope our opponent misses on Land Drop one more time. Because if we hit a natural land drop, then can, yeah, now we're now they're gonna reflector mage one of these. Why wow, they're playing a green? No, okay. And now we need to snap Inquisition the other reflector mage while keeping attacking. Unless they have just another. How many of these do they have? They've got four cards, and I know them all. Okay, and they have so they have two reflector mages. That's gross. I'm 
Maybe I messed up. Maybe I had to make give myself that out. Let's start with this. Lightning Bolt and would you another Gurmag Angler. Jesus. All right, well, if I put this on the bottom, put this on top, there's a chance that they don't um, that they don't block this, and then I can just bolt them out of the game. But I don't see why they wouldn't block, yeah. So now do I want to just... I almost want to just Faithless Looting. No, we're going to have time, I think. Because they're going to play another Reflector Mage. And they're going to take at least one more damage off of it. So then I can, like, bolt them, Snapcaster, bolt them, and try to win the game. Now I wasted a mana though, so I should I should have looting. Now they're gonna name the okay. So now they're gonna name so. What are they gonna do here? Because they have Mantis Rider, Meddling Mage. That's exactly seven points of damage. Unless I go Snapcaster Inquisition, take the Mantis Rider, which I think I've got to do, as sad as that feels. Ooh, they can get with a, with a target on the stack, they can vial this Meddling Mage in and then call the Inquisition. Yeah, this is, this is not great. Yeah. So now they name the Inquisition. It's been kind of a throttle in here. Okay, that's fine. So now we wait. I wish we were at one more. Because I can go block this, bolt the Mantis Rider. That's coming down. Two. So that means they drew a Lieutenant. So now I just offer this trade, then wait, pass priority. This probably leaves me on no outs because I don't have a way to bolt, I don't have a way to uh, deal enough damage. And they have another Reflector Mage, yeah, we're, just, we're super dead. That's a tough matchup in game one. It gets better after sideboard, but that's pretty, like, that's pretty tough game one. After sideboard, I just basically move into a control deck. And like hopefully plan to get there. Okay, so I got Liliana's, Spell Bombs, Lava Mancers of Braids. I'm gonna cut my Street Wraiths, cut my two Gurmag Anglers, cut my stubs. So there's eight. Here's nine, so nine for nine. Now we just have a lot more removal, and we know what to keep, what to mulligan to. I'm going to cut Thoughtsies on the play for another Coladon's command. Probably look to bring the Thoughtsies back in on the draw. Humans is good. Humans is a tough matchup. So maybe I needed to keep another land in order to snap Battle Rage. I'm going to play slower. Think about it more, I think. I need a Death Shadow. If I had a Death Shadow in that game, I might have been able to play a little more aggressive. Aggressively.
Maybe I didn't play that right. I don't think I played that right. I think I, I think I just I think I muffed that one up. We have a lot of good cards though to help this one out. More removal, engineered explosives, Liliana Last Hope. I should have played slower. I would like to play first. Yes. Okay, it sounds pretty good. We'll just lead off on the swamp. So definitely taking a kite sail freebooter. It's a lot of reflector mages. Wish I had a meddling mage for their reflector mages. This is gonna be a grind. So I'm gonna get blood crypt with this. Okay, so I'm going to ditch a Scalding Tarn and a Snapcaster Mage. Because I can pick it back up if I need to with Liliana. Okay, so there's another Ancient Ziggurat. No way. God, no. They ripped a freaking... Oh, that's so bad. I cannot believe they ripped another Kite Sail Freebooter. All right, so now we're going to get down two one ones. And then I, like, I kind of want to flashback Faith is looting, but I also want to deal more damage. Okay, that's great. So now... I just go get steam vents. Pull this. Play this. Tick up on the Thalia's Lieutenant. Then crack for eight. They have three reflector mages, so this game's far from over. Especially if they, if they hit another land drop. Which appears that they didn't. Alright, Oriac Champion's also really good. So let's flash this back. I should have. That was stupid. I should have picked up. I should have kept a fetch land, picked up my death shadow, and they'd be larger. And then they, they all would be lethal next turn. That was dumb. Yeah, that was just stupid. Yeah, that was, like, because then I could just keep the land, fetch shock, play shadow. Champion, okay. And then champion on Oriac champion, okay. Now I just roll back Snapcaster Mage and bolt this thing. It's pretty good as well. Roll back, get Snapcaster Mage. Snapcaster bolt the champion. Hang on. If I attack with everything and then bolt myself, it doesn't really matter. So I should bolt this.
But then we're still going to keep being able to pile it on. Because we're going to re start Reflector Maging some of my creatures. Them getting two life a turn is going to be tough, though. Or two life a creature. I definitely messed up by not making my Death Shadows larger in the beginning. So that they would hit harder. Because these are these just aren't these are kind of puny. Here comes Reflector Mage. Oh, they image. They're just gonna image it. Jesus Christ! I need an engineered explosives. Bad. Okay, that should do something. So now they just block here. I think I just swing out with the team here. They probably go block, block, block. And then I battle rage over the top. That should be enough. Yeah, it's definitely enough. Got lucky there. I did not play well though. I should I need to slow down here. Because I should have what I should have done is I should have ditched my death shadow, kept a fetch land, and then brought it back. So on the draw, I'm gonna bring in another thought seize and I'm gonna cut a Coligon's command just to be a little leaner. And then just run it all back the same. Yeah, that was pretty savage. It was mistakes by me. Like I I that game should have been a blowout. I got lucky to top deck the bolt to kill the whatever it is the big dum dum um the freebooter but i gotta slow down so if i don't have like a turn one removal spell i think i'm gonna mulligan like whether it's lightning bolt or grim lava mancer or fatal push which might mean that i need more answers in my deck. Like this is this is an easy mulligan. I think I better keep this. Ship everything that's not a removal spell. Okay, Noble Hierarch, that's not good. Um I think we're going to try to protect our life total. So the problem, I'm going to take this Dark Confidant because that's just going to run away with the game. And that should tell my opponent that I don't have any removal spells. Okay, they're just going to get the Oriok Champion down, which is decent. So I can go Serum Visions, oh, Thalia, okay. So now I can take the Oriok Champion, which I'll take here. Should I get an island? We gotta go slow. Then he's gonna freebooter my Serum Visions. Grim Lava Mancer off the top would be the nut. Engineer Explosives would be the nut. They don't have a Reflector Mage. I'm in decent shape. At least we're not getting punished by this Noble Hierarch. Like, they really haven't had a good Noble Hierarch draw. Unless they can double spell right here. Like if they have a Thalia's Lieutenant here, I'm going to throw it. Their paying costs. They hit Meddling Mage. We're just going to name Gurmag Angler. That's also bad. So we need Engineer Explosives.
That is not an engineer explosives. Okay. I'm not sure what if it was. I mean, maybe it's correct to go to five. I'm not sure. So we get a red land. Blood crypt. Bobble even cost me a mana. Um, put this one. They're doing a vial, which is at least good for the home team. I might have to flash this Snapcaster Mage in the block. Yeah, I think I'm I think I'm going to. I just need to buy myself time. Just chump this Dahlia. This card's so annoying it's got first strike. All right, let's looting land K command. So let's get rid of the Snapcast Mage. Let's get rid of this Thought Seize. I think that's the nail in the coffin. Graft Digger's Cage is also pretty bad. Okay. Bolt this. I might as well command. No, I have to bolt this, then flash the Snapcaster Mage in to block the Meddling Mage. And just all hope my opponent doesn't have anything as well. What is this? Oh, so they know I have the Snapcaster? I thought it was a lieutenant. Well, this is just named Snapcaster Mage. Well, actually, they don't know about this Snapcaster Mage. Big old push. So we'll bolt this. Snapcaster block this. Whatever. Go to one. Jeez. So what do I do with this? What do I do with my K command? I probably just return Gurmag Angler. I probably should do this right now so that my opponent doesn't. Yeah. So they don't like Thalia's Lieutenant me out of the game.
Uh, they have a graph digger's cage. So we're dead to, we're still dead. I shouldn't have made that play. Yeah, because we're still dead to Thalia's Lieutenant. Yeah. That was a dumb play. I think it was like probably my best play, but I shouldn't have done it right then, because if I'm worrying about Thalia's Lieutenant, I'm dead anyways. Yeah. All right, born two. All right, cube time. We only have 11 matches still in progress. Holy shit. All right, let's stop the video.